So the next thing is uh, kind of fun with sound. Now I, I have to, uh, I, I really have to give credit where credit's due here. Um, Mr. Where is he? Mr. John Walkenbach. We all, we all know and love him. This is where I originally got this idea. Uh, when I discovered that you can play a wave sound, and you know when you can use a macro to play sound effects, it changed my life. I mean, I'm telling you, <laughs> I can amuse myself all day and day long. Believe you me. Uh, as you guys know, I'm a big fan of the sound effects. So uh, what I've done, and that the way that this tip came about was, um, I, I saw who who somebody blogged about, you know. Um, Everybody's QAT. They they took you know yours was oh, on there. Oh, that was Chris Lester. Chris Macro. That's right, Chris Mac. Yeah. So he you know listed I, I guess a handful of people and what they had on their QAT. So I was like, oh, what's on? My... Mine's all sound effects. So as you know, I do lots of live presentations and uh, talking about Excel for hours on end can be really hard. So sound is a great way to see if your audience is engaged. Uh, you can attach sound uh, to a worksheet event. Um, or a button on your QAT. So, for example, now that was just a sound clip on. So I have all of these on my QAT. So I, I have a handful of them for various, you know, uh, scenarios that may come up. Of course, the one when nobody's listening. You know, you got your crickets. Um, when everybody's, you know, you get the glazed looks. Little little Scooby noise. So the way that this works is I've got these in my I keep these in my personal macro workbook. Here's a little my my little music tab, and it's very simple. You just have this. Uh, Jordan probably knows exactly what all this means. But <laughs> so at the top you have this uh, statement here, this declaration of the the function sound play sound 32 whatever the heck that is. Uh, this I just copied from. John Walkenbach. Then you want to have a folder where you keep all of your favorite wave files, right? So I moved all mine to a folder called None of Your Business. And um, so there I've got my laugh track, uh, my applause, my crickets, my little meow mix song, my Scooby noise. And so when the situation calls for it, I can play the appropriate sound effect. So I've taken these and I've just attached them to uh, my QAT. So you know, when I need applause, I got my applause. It's right there at my fingertips. I got my Hungarian violins. Um, you know, and after a while, you kind of remember which ones these are. So um, you can also, as I mentioned earlier, you can attach these to worksheet events. So, for example, this worksheet, whenever this recalculates, um, if if the amount of departments over budget is greater than zero, then you get a little sad trombone noise, and then you know you get your little pop-up message. So you know, just just trying to just trying to keep things interesting. That's that's what I got for you all today. All right, right. awesome. You know, you've been you've been using that soundtrack ever since Sylvia came on last time. So I'm curious how many uh, sriracha she's getting on this one. You know what, man? This 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 is a glorious day. This is just plain <laughs> glorious. You know that? Wow. 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 Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, that's right. Man, this this is a wonderful, wonderful day.